channel or welcome to my channel for those of you guys who are new my name is culture sims and today we are going to be playing the sims 4 horse ranch series so i'm going to be doing a series on the horse ranch i am very excited to be playing again honestly i have not uploaded in a few months and you guys have been asking where i've been and i'm just kind of taking it easy at the moment and i really want to play um some horse ranch with you guys so let's go ahead and get on into it so i'm going to have um you guys meet the family a little bit so getting on into the family we have Kennedy Stone right here. She is a young adult. Um, she's kind of undecided on what she wants to do with life. She started thinking about going to uni and then she kind of changed her mind and put it on the back burner because her grandparents' health started going a little bit downhill and she wanted to kind of help her grandparents out. So she ended up moving in with her grandparents for a little while. Um, once they got better, she moved back home home with her family and she's kind of getting back into the whole ranch life so she ended up adopting a horse which is winter this is her horse right here um, so she may go to uni um, to meet some people and see if she wants to go into a different career or if she's just going to become a rancher like her grandparents and her parents um, all of her family is ranchers so I feel like she kind of wants to break the cycle a little bit and maybe do something different but she's still tempted to get into that ranch life um I mean can you blame her though look at this horse it's so cute I kind of can't blame her for wanting to kind of get back into that horse life so that's Kennedy and then oops let me get out of my camera mode and then we have let's see where are you big boy where are you why are you hiding in the bushes <laughs> what no let's have you come over here I can see your gardening baby boy but no we need to we need to get a good look at you so this is her brother this is Brandon Stone and he is all about that ranch life he is country head to toe guys country head to toe he is just like his grandfather in every way loves everything southern and he is trying to be a true rancher um, he is a teenager he is still in high school um, a little bit of his backstory he actually Actually ended up meeting someone in high school he fell in love with her and they got pregnant and the family was very supportive her family was not very supportive um, her family ended up making her get an abortion and after that um, her and Brandon kind of fell apart because you know he wanted to keep the baby he's he's very family oriented and they kind of fell apart and she ended up leaving him um, he was kind of planning like like his whole future around her he wanted to propose to her and she just kind of broke his heart and I I feel for him so maybe we'll find him another girlfriend in the future and see how things work out with that and hopefully a little sweetheart can can find him a little country girl or something I don't know so this is the brother Brandon and then we have Rachel which is our little newborn baby sis sis <laughs> where are you a little baby sis sis oh she's in the crib okay let me see if I can like pan my camera down on her because like she is just too cute guys she's just too cute I forget how to use the sims 3 camera oh my goodness okay so this is baby Rachel she's super adorable and she is an infant right now so I don't know what her life goal is gonna be obviously she's still a baby so we we have a long way to go with her you guys can even help with that so this is Ryan Stone he is a child and he's kind of figuring himself out like he's not particularly into the ranch life he kind of likes painting and he likes doing comics and graphic art um, 
um, he kind of wants to be an artist and I don't know if he's going to end up following that dream, but that's his dream at the moment. So we got him like a little easel and he's kind of been experimenting with all of that great stuff. So yeah, guys, so that's the family. Um, we do have grandparents who are in game. We also have our uncle. Um, they are not over, but we will be seeing them throughout the series. Um, just in case if you guys are wondering, the grandparents names are Brad and Melanie and then we have Uncle Charles. Uh, so yeah, that is kind of where we are right now, guys. Let's go ahead and get on into the season. I'm so happy. Season one is starting. Hopefully you guys like it. If you do, definitely give it a like and let me know down below because if you guys do not like the series, then I will probably not continue it. But if you're excited, definitely show it some love. So we did just adopt winter i kind of want to start training her we definitely need to start getting our garden done because we need to start getting some more income we have fifty thousand, which our grandparents gifted to us um, to renovate our home this was a fixer upper home and we ended up renovating it um, and they gave us a little bit of a starter fund you know to buy some horses and trying to get going um, but whatever we did not need we had to gift back um, as like you know paying off some of the loan that we gave them so um we ended up making up some money and we're gonna start paying them back some of the loan that we have for them um <clears throat> so they're gonna be kind of broke so we're gonna need to start farming and start getting up some money start training these horses up so that we can get some horse ranch uh money going if you know what i mean so let's go ahead and get on into that let's see i think the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna have dad come on over and we are going to purchase some seasonal seeds. Uh, what season is this? This is fall. So let's come on over here and we're going to order some seeds. Definitely, I recommend when you do this and you're kind of like, um, you know, purchasing seeds and stuff like that, always try and do like <laughs> the seasonal seeds because it helps so much um, with you not getting random stuff. So let's see what we can get. Okay guys, so we have a few different kind of plants that we're going to start off with. We have some mushrooms up here, we have a couple of carrots, and then we have some grapes. I did also get some apples, which I've planted a few apple trees around, which our lovely wife Vanessa is going to help us out with. While he's doing that, I think we're gonna have Kennedy come over here and maybe try and mount Winter and see if we can't get her to train. Um, um, if I can find winter, where are you at, babes? <laughs> where are you at? Come on. <laughs> Who left food outside? I mean, free food, right? I'm gonna I'm gonna put it in the fridge. I'm pretty sure it's from the um <laughs> what is it? Like the welcoming gathering or whatever. Uh like, hey, welcome to the neighborhood. They're probably just bringing me food. I mean, I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. <laughs> free food. So let's go ahead and see if we can mount winter. I want to see, oh, do you guys like each other? Do you guys like each other? Oh, that could be cute. Like you guys could totally end up having a baby. Um, so let's see. Oh, I love this. I love this so, so much. Oh, this is her first time mounting a horse. Let's see if we can come over here and practice some barrels. Let's see if we can do that. I really want to like get their skills up so that they can start in uh competitions i think that's gonna be so great so if you guys are wondering i did already start playing um this pack i mean i've had the pack for like i think a month or two now however long it's been out i had pre-ordered it um so i've been playing it off camera so i kind of have a gist of how the expansion pack goes but i've not played it on camera yet so we're going to be experiencing a lot of it together um but we're also going to be kind of like seeing how the family goes and everything i'm super excited about this so we have her she's working on her skills um mom is what's wrong with mom uh can list all the movie mistakes oh my gosh girl you're you're mad about a movie like you're tensed up mad too we're gonna leave you alone <laughs> we're just gonna leave you alone we're gonna come over here and we are just going to kind of like just 
we're gonna just do our plants that's all we're gonna worry about we're just worried about plants you're in your mood we'll leave you that um so winter has acquired the agility skill nice and vanessa reached parenting level one uh babes you have three other kids okay like whatever <laughs> I probably should have like cheated some skills in but I mean I have no problem starting these off at like zero um, so Rachel Stone has a quirk she's good appetite so Rachel really loves to eat infants with the good appetite quirk will always appreciate or will always accept the opportunity to feed and they'll finish almost any food regardless of how hungry they are um, uh, infants or each infant is difficult from the next and has three quirks that can be discovered over time wow so she's a foodie basically my little chunk but i mean i i can't blame her <laughs> food is great <laughs> food is great so you know what let's see if we can have brandon come on over on chestnut and let's see if oh my god the mini goats are like heckling the horses look at this guys <laughs> i am dead so we have some mini goats um definitely leave some like mini goat names we just kind of have a couple that came with our like home um that we renovated so i don't really know their names okay so we have mocha we have black mini sheep so a couple of them don't have names but a few do um so i mean guys we have some goats I, and some sheeps. Wait, oh my god, we have sheeps and goats. Oh, that is so cute. Um, so let's come on over here and see if we can have Chestnut practice just some basic jumping. Oh my god, you better not. You better not buck off my baby, okay? Like, he is my child. I I will make you into glue. No, I'm just kidding. I totally won't. But like, do not kill my sim, okay? Um, I wonder, like, I know that your sims can get bucked off and I've had it happen a few times, but I wonder if you can die from it. I really don't know and I'm kind of curious <laughs> I mean I'm not curious to find out with my sims but like I'm curious if it's like, even possible uh, so chestnut has acquired the jumping skill nice he will be he will begin to help uh, oh my goodness chestnuts new skill in jumping will begin to help him perform better when he is using horse jumps great great it is super late we are hungry we have to pee we have a lot of stuff going on babes did you do your homework did you do your homework like do your homework <laughs> okay um also brandon you're gonna have to do your homework too babes but we're kind of just letting you you know have your little fun um so Brandon doesn't necessarily have his own horse. We are kind of thinking of buying him one. We kind of just had the family horse, which was Chestnut. And um, when Kennedy came home, she bought Winter with her own money. Um, so that's kind of why she has a horse before Brandon. But I think we may rescue a horse for Brandon and see if he can like train them up a little bit. Oh, this is just too cute, babes. If you have to pee, please do because we do not need you peeing on yourself. Um, you are super energized and you're gonna try and push to the limit. Okay, okay okay guys so everyone's kind of hungry so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna come on over here and we are going to cook some dinner uh let's see what we have for dinner that we can cook it's a little chilly maybe we can have like some ramen or something maybe some kind of soup um i feel like <laughs> girl i don't even know i mean i feel like I feel like the spicy uh, ramen would be pretty good. Um, so let's come and make up like a party size of some ramen. Okay guys, so I had to do a little bit of rearranging. I couldn't figure out if it was the sink that was messing things up or if it was the decor on the stove and it was actually the decor on the stove. So we're actually going to make dinner and Brandon could not wait. So he's eating whatever the welcome wagon brought. He's just gonna clean that up really quickly. Um, and I guess everyone else is kind of just taking a nap, waiting for dinner to be done. We are off to a really busy day. It's midnight. They just moved into the house and got everything done after renovating this place for so long. Um, so hopefully they enjoy the ramen and then we can all go to bed and have a nice fresh start in the morning. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to have them go ahead and eat and then go to bed and I'll be back with you guys in the morning. But first... 
can we appreciate how darn good this ramen looks like oh my god it looks so good oh my gosh i could go for some ramen right now actually um okay so let me go ahead and get to the rest of the night and i'll see you guys in the morning Alrighty, everyone so it is morning time fun fact i actually pre-recorded the first part like a month ago so much has happened since then so if i can't remember their names bear with me okay so i believe in the last part i ended off at night and ended up uh getting um a little bit fast tracked into morning um i did buy the new pack that came out recently it's like the the new kitchen pack so you know we have like the little pizza oven and the mixer um we're gonna send brandon alone <laughs> and we got like the little waffle maker so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna have mama bear come on over here and cook up some waffles um i think berry waffles sounds pretty good now we do have brandon going off to school we do have kennedy um i forget if she's a young adult or not um she is a young adult okay that's right we because we weren't sure if she was going to go to uni or not um so brandon is off to school hopefully to make some friends because boo you need some friends <laughs> i am still loving this new little stuff pack i think it's so adorable um they do take time to cook which i think is super cool and realistic um how about while you're waiting you come and clean this up a little bit um what's up with you you're gonna oh you're gonna empty it for us okay so no pet is truly fearless even sub each pet has its own unique fears babe what's what's wrong um what are we doing we're chatting that's great but how about we come over here um and we pet uh seb and we maybe give uh seb a bath because <laughs> dingy <laughs> um what is ryan up to ryan is sleeping and now he's not <laughs> oh he needs to go to school oh babes i'm so sorry i totally did not get you up in time did i and then we just have baby rachel who is sleeping oh uh, let's see Family dynamic, Vanessa and Kennedy being jokesters. Yeah, I mean, they joke all the time. We're not going to bed too. <laughs> we, we're we not going to bed too, I'm sorry. Like we could literally go everywhere except bed too. Um, so are these waffles done yet? Nine? Oh, okay. Collect the waffles, girl. They're done. <laughs> like what the crap? Um, we're hungry and we want these waffles. I want to see how they look oh my god guys these waffles look so good girl where'd you put these waffles <laughs> where okay like like dude like look at these waffles these look so good they look so good okay so let's come on over here we're gonna grab a serving i'm pretty sure you're hungry ish <laughs> Um, you're gonna grab a serving as well. You're not really hungry, but babes is hungry. You're late for school. Then go to school, my dude. They <laughs> go to school. Okay. Um, hopefully we can have him make some friends as well. So let's come on over and make some friends. I feel like you can never have too many friends in The Sims because you just, I don't know if it's just me, but like, I always feel like my Sims never have friends and they never go out and do anything. Um, they're either working or they're home, like sleeping. They never have friends to go out and do anything. Uh, look at you guys like in sync and everything. Okay. Okay. Do the darn thing. So I'm going to go ahead and put these waffles in the fridge so they don't go bad. <clears throat> I think for sure I want to have Kennedy practice riding today because i want to see if we can start getting into some competitions and hopefully the horses are in like good moods because i have not checked on them i'm not okay so chestnut winter babes you look fine you look great dandy um so we're gonna come over here clean your hooves we're going to talk to you a little bit and then we're gonna try and mount you because i really really want to see if we can get some riding in 
nice Seb's looking all great 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 and you know what else actually let's have um, let's have dad come over here and practice riding chestnut because I think we can get him to practice as well knowing your scholarships you know what I wonder if Brandon would even be interested in going to uni I I really don't know I really don't because I mean like I mean he's still in high school he's been through so much already but like I don't know if uni is something he's interested in that I guess that's something we'll have to play around with and see okay guys so let's go ahead and enter into a competition I think we're gonna do beginner comp well we don't really have a choice actually we're gonna do beginner endurance um, I'm not gonna do barrel racing only because we haven't even tried barrel racing um, with winter so we're gonna do endurance we're going to change to ch uh, not chestnut but winter um, we might be okay we may not it looks like how and just bumped my elbow Um, so it's looking like for endurance we need at least level three and we're level one in both um what was chestnut though so chestnut's at least good in jumping i don't know i still say we're gonna try with our horse if not we're gonna lose 100 simoleons we gotta we gotta try <laughs> i feel like we just have to try so let's go ahead and stop this what's going on brandon brad hey brandon i'm in town for a while and i was wondering if i could stay at your place for a few days it'll be fun meanwhile in the background rachel's just having like a monster blowout <laughs> yuck it was bound to happen but rachel had her first blowout hopefully the diaper will hold next time mm, probably not knowing my luck <clears throat> but do i want you to come over i mean your family i guess <laughs> I guess you can come on over bro it'll be okay maybe um, okay so we're gonna go to our horse competition so, meanwhile we're getting bucked off of winter oh this is gonna be a great start and our dog is running away bro we get bucked off our horse our dog runs away grandpa decides he wants to come and visit for a few days and he heads to the barn question mark is that where we're gonna stay I mean that would be kind of cute like if I made like a little like a like room out here for like guests and whatnot but at the same time grandpa grandpa why are you why are you outside though grandpa like I mean at least put your junk in this one okay <laughs> grandpa is just like darn kids don't have a room for me but said I could come over and stay I think we literally have enough rooms for just one Oh my god, she's green. Oh my god. Do your motherly duties and clean your child. <laughs> Bro, give her a bubble bath. Like, take care of your baby. At least she's not hungry. Yeah, come over here. No, you're not going to cry for dad. Mom is going to come and be a mother, okay? Mom is going to be a mother. <clears throat> yes, take care of your child. She is literally green right now. Okay. So, Kennedy is off at her horse race. Oh, I hope she does good. I doubt she's going to, but, like, hopefully she does. Um, so, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to fix these, and I'm going to come on over here and practice some barrels, because we've not practiced the barrels yet with Chestnut, and maybe he could use some barrel racing. Okay, so we got Silver Place. Not too bad. Not too bad. We did get 250 simoleons, which is over double of what we made because I think we only spent 100 to enter the competition and we made 250 so that's pretty good um, especially for being our very first competition and really having no skill so we're gonna have um <clears throat> what is his name Beck <laughs> we're gonna have Beck and Chestnut come on over here and practice the barrels and girl you got to pee you got to pee um so we're gonna let you go and do that and I think we're gonna have you Oh, are you, are you, wait, is this, is this goat hurting you? Is this her, is this goat hurting you? Please don't tell me that you seriously have no friends to where your only friend is like a little sheep. And actually I can't even say that because the sheep does not like you <laughs> at all. You poor thing. Okay, we're going to come inside and do our homework. <laughs> 
Oh, I feel so bad for, for my Sims. Like, literally was telling you they have no friends, have no life. And my Sim is like, yeah, I have no friends. So I'm going to befriend our sheep. No. <laughs> Even the sheep doesn't want to be his friend. Like, that is so sad. So I think we're just going to have him come up here and be a loner and do his homework. <laughs> just be good. <clears throat> okay. So you have showered. You have your little competition um thing. Little trophy. Where's your bedroom, Boo Boo? Where's your bedroom? Okay. Um, can I hang this somewhere? Like, how big is this? Oh, okay. Um, here's the thing. I don't have anywhere to put it. I need to find somewhere to put it. But I have nowhere to put it. Now, do these only mount like they do? Oh, darn. Or we're just going to stick it there. I was going to say, like, can they also, like, sit on tabletops? Because that would be pretty cool. Um, let's see. You also need to come and take a shower. Brandon. <clears throat> What's up, baby? Why are you sad? Because you stink, you're hungry, you're tired, and you have no fun. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, well, we're going to, uh, you know, let you work on that a little bit first bath okay that just shows you that my sims are terrible parents first bath hmm and it's not even the mother giving the child a bath is it nope do you have any motherly instinct or are you just like a terrible mother i'm questioning this i'm questioning this so bad how did you have kids and you know you're like a terrible mother i don't i don't understand this Let's see, so you are still doing that. We're gonna have you come on over and get off this horse, cause baby, you got to pee, <laughs> like real bad. So we're gonna have you pee, take a shower, and how about we have a pizza? I think a pizza would be pretty good. What kind of pizza options do we have? I've played with the waffle maker a little bit in my other save file, but I've not really played with the pizza machine. Um, so we have pizza marinara, we have a cheese pizza, we have a margarita pizza, um, pepperoni, herb, pineapple, blah, um, <laughs> pizza caliente, we have a sweet corn pizza, that sounds pretty good, um, Canadian bacon, ooh, yas, a seafood pizza, okay, you lost me, no, <clears throat> a curious pizza, oh my lord, oh my lord, <laughs> I think we're just gonna have a normal, like, pepperoni pizza i think a pepperoni pizza you can't go wrong with pepperoni pizza you can't go wrong with cheese pizza with black olives either but like a pepperoni pizza is to die for and out of all of those pizza options did you guys notice that there was no supreme there was not a supreme pizza so i'm definitely gonna have to check my cc creators and see if one of them makes a uh supreme pizza because how do you how do you not have a supreme pizza in there but yet you have a curious pizza see now i'm curious it's so weird what is this oh <laughs> that is just like the cutest little thing ever i love that oh my gosh guys <laughs> then we just have gramps just over here like oh, bro bro <laughs> okay <clears throat> so where where are you going to the bathroom like which bathroom oh okay i mean because like there are so many bathrooms in this house i say that i think there's like three and then you can just see brandon over there bored as can be um you're not going to get any food right yes you're making pumple <laughs> pumpkin spice waffles i mean i can't be mad at that but at the same time i'm coming over here to literally make a pizza and you set the house on fire gah go wait where the freak where the freak is the fire coming from yeah extinguish like it was not even registering that there was a fire and literally burnt up all of my counters <clears throat> wow disappointed disappointed see kennedy babes that's why you just don't you just you just don't cook okay you're just not the cook of the family just accept that babe just accept it okay so again come up in here and cook me a pepperoni pizza first visitor visitors oh wait boo you've seen your grandpa before what you talking about what is you talking about 
save Rachel from the fire? I mean, you're doing an awesome job at it. You're doing an awesome, awesome job at it. <laughs> and just casually walks over there, just gently picks her up like, oh yeah, there's a fire, but I'm just going to take my sweet time with it. I do not understand Sims. Like, I really don't. Y'all just, I don't know. Y'all ain't got no oomph. <laughs> Y'all just, the only time they have oomph and they actually get like out of the house, I think is like when there's a lightning storm and the lightning strikes and they're terrified of it, but they'll run outside. Like they'll even wake up out of a dead sleep and run outside. <clears throat> but like a fire, oh, no big deal. <laughs> oh guys, this is so cool. I love this. Even puts it on like a little pizza tray. Look at that. Oh, that is so cute. How long is this gonna take? 26 minutes. Bro, so you're gonna come over here and make waffles? Pizza and waffles. Okay. <laughs> I can't, I can't be mad at that. Guys, there's another fire. Where is this one from? The waffle maker again? Seriously? Seriously. I mean, Kennedy discovered the fire. What is up with this waffle maker? Guys, this is the second time this waffle maker has set my house on fire. Yeah, I think we're just not gonna mess with this waffle maker. <laughs> Bro, I think we need a new waffle maker. <laughs> what? <sighs> what? No. Oh my god. Oh my god. And yet he's coming to rescue this baby. I mean, good, but like... Let me collect this pizza. Bro. Okay, so we're gonna replace the counter, but we're not gonna replace that janky waffle maker because that's the second time it's caught fire. Uh, I don't know if it's just my Sims just not knowing how to use it, but like the pizza machine worked fine. Like, I don't understand. I really don't. Where's the baby? Okay, take the baby. Put the baby in her bed. That would be great. And it would also be great if you guys would stop setting the house on fire, but you know. You know, beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> okay. Come on over here. Don't worry about this fire. Come and get this pizza, bro. No, don't see what happened. Get the pizza before it burns and it catches fire. Brandon's just like, look, I'm just grabbing some food and I'm out. <laughs> okay, I'm out. I want to see how this one looks. Oh, that looks pretty good. Wait, why is it in a to-go box? That's, okay, that's kind of weird that we made it at home, but it's in a to-go box. So let's call to meal, because I'm sure we're all starving, and there is eight servings, so that's pretty good. I guess it, like, automatically makes a good amount of servings, because you know how, like, when you cook, you can kind of choose, like, if you just want, like, a single plate, or if you just want a couple. This one doesn't let you do that. So I guess these are automatically, like, family size servings. I don't know what the little mixer does, too. I'm gonna have to try that out <laughs> but bro like this pizza looks like bye okay like I really want some pizza now what time is it crap it's almost one o'clock in the morning yeah my pizza shop is definitely not open <laughs> oh man I do I actually do I think I have a frozen pizza in the fridge though or in the freezer uh, but again I do not need to make a frozen pizza at one o'clock in the morning but I'll just let my Sims have that. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys. Fire beyond fire beyond fire. So I think that's going to be it for the first episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you guys give a like down below. If you guys have any videos that you would like to see, like Sims Free Play or Sims Mobile or any kind of app game or computer game, definitely let me know down below. And I hope that you guys decide to subscribe. I know that I have not been active lately and I do apologize for that. I'm trying to get back into the mood of filming and the more that you guys request, the more that I'll want to film. So definitely leave me some suggestions down below and hope that you guys have an amazing day or night wherever you are and I will see you all in my next one. Bye guys.